Well, welcome away, Jets, to another video. And today we were playing Kira on this one. So this is my very first quick game on stream that I was playing Kira. And the build honestly consists of Inferno, Viper, Imp, Terminus, and White Hawk. You can change White Hawk to a sure if you really need to. Um, this is the first time I'm doing a post edit video. I feel I like things like this a bit more to tell me because it's on accident, I would say. Um, it's really not much, but um, if you haven't already, Kira, aka I will always call her Huntress, is a brand new hero. Uh, originally from Omega Serials, uh, from Predecessor, not from Paragon. Use assets that are, you know, spread wrapped around the internet everywhere around here in the game so um this is a reimagining of their own hero first time doing this it's been a while since i played carry i'm a still support uh in the draft people talk about he usually want to play murdoch so he had carry main but um you will see right here um uh, my support will be kills so what i'm doing now for early game was just poking at their seal last hitting doing like boop, doo, 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 doo. but um at the same time in doing so um look at what's going to happen next is the shield bush um shield burst i said okay cool they they, 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 they they still have shield burst i don't know why i usually do understand the shield to deny farm but it's also used against Revenants because Revenant where you do that. Okay, my seal going in. Get some hits. I got solid damage on their seal, but they got level two before us, so I still have to be very cautious what's going to happen very, very soon. Oop. Uh oh. They're fighting the seal because they even know he was level one. He killed himself in the minions. Nope. Oh, there you go. First kill. They carry got the first kill. Now it's gonna be a boss match, but I can't aim for for damn. So, Bomb one versus Sakura. He died in the tower, but guess what? One one trade. She two one, but at least I got one kill out my one death out here. And you will see like the different spikes levels when I did White and Hulk. Um, first. So. I know people are saying, why Whitehall oh, not uh, oh, Venture no. or Terminus? So I was just trying Whitehall first. I just feel like I need it at a speed. And also, the reason I also go Whitehall, not only because of the like, traditional carry build, was because for some reason um, that I pair it with her slow that she already have in her kit. Her like swear, her X is like her swirl or and keyboard turns Q um, is her slow in her kit so I can't aim you see what I'm, I'm talking about I can't aim I can't aim if I want to aim better <laughs> you, you count the miss all A's how many of all do you miss you missed eight what eight you had two kills there, man. I mean, man, I, I tell you, that's why I don't really play carry as much. But it's also during this time, I think it was like weird things happen with like people playing on controller. So I was like doing things like saying, I, I play that more on my aim, not the only issues that happen on controller lately. Because um, my aim kind of crappy. I think this is why y'all see me mainly play as like melee heroes. Knowing my aim is kind of bad. Don't don't get the wrong idea. I can play range, but I, I carry range sometimes. Kind of mur murky, bro. I'll be honest with you. We also were joined by a Queen in the video playing the Chimera in the jungle. So she got my back. It was like we would do a queue in this game together. 
um, the web page came in, I should have known better to just stay there because I was like doing this saying, you know what? I hope the cure just go ahead and pull in, but my team cleaned up the cure. And uh, I just felt kind of bad because I was like saying, yeah, I made some like dumb mistakes. <laughs> I mean, very dumb. So I'm like, um, in doing these things. We try to get the controller back together around here. We're going to check out the Dango Noodles. Because it like, uh, for some reason, this game, I feel like was like, the well, I say like, like 20 times, but it feel like I'm moving so slow when playing on uh, controller this game. For some reason, I, I couldn't put my hands on it because that's why you see like the keyboard bindings right now because I was walking with the keyboard and see how I could shoot with like, um, and I move around with the keyboard and mouse a little bit before I actually trust match my controller because uh it's a little different. And the other thing is like um I usually play with Rumble on on controller to get like a feel if I would take damage if I was like completely looking on the map when not really looking. As like doing that like helps me out a little bit more than being on mouse like saying I could take damage and look my health bar. But sometimes I have a tendency to just don't do that. And it's just like for the immediate response that why I usually got Wumble on. Okay. So now we're back to the action here. We're going to try and fight for Fane 2. Um, I'm going to say in 2v1 because they don't know where we're going. The only person there is Howie. We have a Drongo off lane. The Drongo pushing the hell out of that cell. The best he can, trying to take warm him off on the other side. Still finally coming over into the uh, fame pit, but I think it will be too late on their team. So now they all come in there. Now I'm going in myself after all this mess. Ooh, and after this, I think Arceal died in this one. Yeah, but everyone else got out. Now that was like my decision, like saying not going in there, because I was like saying, okay, I'm going to get some farm beforehand, because um, I think I was a little bit behind on CS compared to the other hunters, and I think after this, I think my seal would just roll me ever after this, after this thing, because um, it was not really bad. I'm like saying I was doing like. A decent job of carrying but not like hyper aggressive knowing also there's a mirror match seal versus seal is just kind of like meh but we also have a combat acid skill weight game with two carries and the counters in mid so we actually have like a good end game you know they have a lot more cc than compared to us on their team so the other thing is like playing Huntress, it feels very rewarding. Uh, because her son, and this this is also another bad play. You see how this works out in my head? So she's gonna blink forward. And I have blinked out. But that was me to like I, I would say, yeah, I should never went back and do that to her. But it rewarded me with a kill of still trying to be greedy with a kill, man. I mean, it's a plus minus kind of thing. The bad news was, um, the seal died uh, again, but I mean, at least I got a kill. <laughs> it's a seal for a seal trade. It's two for two and one. I'm 37 farm and she had 44. I'm still not that far behind. She took at least two gold buffs, so that's the other thing in my head, so. I had to keep that in mind when doing that. Now we got all online, if y'all have not know any of her abilities. And this, this is kind of late into explaining her abilities, but the white kit, the, 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 the white quit can crit as well. There's also a short cooldown when hitting an enemy, so it's like a potent tool that you actually could use. Uh, her E is a dash in ability, dash out. It's kind of remind me like set wall dash, uh, but it give you like free like damage when doing so as well. That's another cool thing about her. I say, oh yeah, so you get a damage 
from just doing that, huh? You just dash it in or dash it out, and you get like a damage for like six seconds. So it's very reasonable, honestly. Right there, <laughs> I took the chance, and I came up the winner. You know, I almost killed two of them, but like both characters, like saying, "Hey, time to day blade, day blade." So we both are spinning, use our alts. This was actually a good old time that one. A uh, good move from um, Queen coming in on there. So this is the secret sauce. So I'm trying Inferno. Um, I did some damages and like doing some practice rounds and I like saying, you know what will be fun with her? Infernum. So, Infernum also worked with her um, true damage a little bit. So, if y'all have not know, I think you stack up to six times with <laughs> Huntress or Kira's passive and you get true damage on the next hit. So, with time too. So, the thing is, it also worked on that, but Infernum works on abilities and base attacks and kindles like Grux bleed so it works like Grux bleed kinda very nice very very strategic and also very useful so now I got more damage than that Kira I believe so but she poked me down with her Abilities. I think I didn't get white seal until the dirt item, so I had white seal kind of late there. But the seal came in the alt. He did good. Now I'm actually going to just back off because he'll be able to eat my dad on weird end up. Yeet. But that was a good seal alt for my dad going seal, man. He was helping the brother out. You know, I was actually doing a poor job in positioning on that one. <coughs> we, <coughs> we, we digress. We digress. But, um, yeah, I moved back. I had to recap with myself. I had to recollect myself and get back into the fight. So, the thing is now my seals versus seal is like, um, 1v1ing with no mana. But, you know, um, we have been pressured this way before. So, guess who came by? Is that Howie from mid lane? He just said, I want to come by and tackle him because of the pressure of my lane. Mm hmm, mm hmm. The Howie didn't want no more, man. The Howie didn't want no more. Now the count's getting tapped because they were fame tubes on the board. And he like saying, Sub said, I want some of the action. So he came over there. Then I'm starting over it, but he getting the level buff on the sub. On the left hand side. On the right hand side. Like, ooh. Oh no, the whole, whole left lane went there. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Sub and Howie and Rampage and Kira and Seal, all five of mid, all five of mid did death balling without objective. Oh no. What do I do? Just walk around to try and get to the, you know, thing to, you know, at this point in time, just walk on by, walk on by, do 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 do, walk on by, do 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 do. It's funny how Sub hitting the dag or Drongo and Drongo really don't feel nothing, bro. I love how the drama like don't feel nothing. Meanwhile, Lampage was just working on the you know thing to by himself, which I don't agree with like with at all. Because um, bro, why are you gonna do that yourself? Why? He gave us a freebie. <laughs> like his whole team was still in mid the same. Hey, we're gonna keep fighting. Meanwhile, this man's the thing. I'm just gonna keep this fame. It's not like Chimera with Soul Sacks, like his sacks uh, for Chimera, like health regen. So I like saying, yeah, and you don't have like a Q ability with Chimera, so you, you're gonna take 20 years for Rampage to even get there, like that. Fame too, in general. So, we go back to farming. I love the Drongo though on our team. He was like very upbeat though in the whole game. Hold it together, and now I got a head. 
on daycare. A1 to purchase nine. So now I'm going to go back, get the next item. So right now we got 40 damage. And now, with a slow and some more damage, let's see how we could do. So, my soul is going on the right hand side saying, hmm, I want them dead. I will alt Kira. Damn, that was actually a lot of damage, surprisingly. So, I need light still. Not bad. New build. They left wing somehow won my great mid. Always, I don't know why they always do that. And this is where I will say is another thing I should improve on because I like to say I won't be in this fight this time, but I was torn between going to the fight and not going to the fight. Did that make any sense? Meaning, um, I won't go mid and help. Don't 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 look at me. I said it said again in the tower because I was saying yeah. At three kills, I can get ahead a little bit more. An ally has been slain. An ally and then I ulted, and I was like, ulted nothing. Because for some reason, I ult. So, noted. The ult don't have the greater distance. This is still getting me wrong. This is my first game in game playing uh, Kira. And the funny part was, that was a blunder. <laughs> so, I thought the range of the alt got a little bit longer, but it's uh, <laughs> very, very, very short. Oh, she got Viper first, by the way. I'm not, surprised. I'm not very surprised about that. Oh, actually, they Viper worked on damaging, so it worked like very well. It also worked with attack. Infernum and her true damage, all one. And that's why I had Viper in my build with Infernum. <laughs> An imp. But I think we didn't see the whole build just go around. And also see the Diago Rampage building Tiny Guard first. Enemy towers destroyed. These people love that boy, man. They love going in mid. Just pick on the counters. So we're just going to shove this lane up now. Here I say, oh my gosh, my tower getting destroyed. What can I do? Enemy towers destroyed. Towers under attack. We don't know where the rampage at. Because I don't trust the rampage at all. The rampage came only like two times already in this lane. So we was just backing off. Yeah, I think I was going back. I, I continue to farm. I continue to farm because for some reason it was they not come down here. They might most likely go mid because for some reason they were pushing so hard. And my team doing a good job cleaning the damn highway. Yep, there they are. See? So I just going back, trying to pick up my next item. Get the quins, and next item will be terminus. Yeah, the terminus kind of wait here. Honestly, I should have got like the first item or a second. To be honest with you, just being honest with the audience, because her alt do white seal through her alt. <laughs> it took me a while to process that in my head. But, um, it's quite interesting. I know why the Rampage got tank card. Not only for me, just for the, um, what's the name? Chimera. Because Chimera also, um, oh, they got it. Mm. Yeah, our team was nowhere in a position to do it. It's not that time. The car still is on right lane. And I like this idea of pushing lanes because they just want to get adjusted. I 
at this point, I'll be handing back to left lane. Now, does he do whatever he want and actually make it easier? I mean, I just get more levels and he could just help out the team. Like, there's still been actually doing the same thing, but just been coming with uh, the cure, like, on the hip. So, it's actually giving me time to just farm and just, like, do 1v1s if need be. Now, it's always going to be a part of that mid lane. And what I'm seeing here is, like, some crazy shenanigans with my Drongo killing the Kira. And say, haha. And the Rampage is, like, cleaning up. Meanwhile, it's four mid, so I was like saying, go ahead and push up left lane. The enemy team like saying, okay, we're going to keep ourselves distracted in uh, mid. Meanwhile, self didn't rotate at all. He was trying to get hit to one tower. And I just like saying, yo, start to move up and uh, take this. And it's only we like two people on my team still in mid. It was only the seal and the counters. And they, they were putting some work seriously together. I think the CC help counts out a lot with her um, E ability. And now I'm actually a little bit ahead. I got one level up on the Kira. So now we're going to just tackle the Kira. We both going to miss some freaking shots. So don't worry about that. We're going to do the right click. And now she's going back. And Inferno was doing some work. I messed up on the alt. But we secured a kill with her Q. I might hear Q actually do a lot. It slows the enemy and actually could do guaranteed kills all at one time. So it was actually very spicy. Like but you saw the tick damage from the true damage from her sacks from Kira passive combined with Inferno with like extra damage. It was kind of crazy. It was popping off very nicely as intended. So. We are into another fight here. Here we go. I'm coming in, boys and girls. Green is on that going rampage. So is Drongo coming in. Go ahead and we gonna clean him up first with the Drongo help. Selves here, still here. Uh oh, Queen gonna get tackled with the seal. Oh oh, okay. But it's two carries here. How are you gonna target two carries? Well, guess what? We got that covered. One carry could focus on one thing, the other carry will focus on over. So guess what? Oh, the carry is trying to all, but it's not that long. But it got Queen. Poor Queen. Now we're going to go on Howie. Going on Howie to try to run away from us. It's no escaping, Howie. You gotta commit your sins. You're gonna die for it. <laughs> now we at 6, 4, and 7. We like 40 CS up top of the carrier because she rotated early all that time and I don't know why because you neglect her farm and we, we've run kind of good now we feel kind of good okay we're going back 2k gold we got some good stuff going on I think we are going for is it viper Oh, imp. Imp. So we're going imp. Now we're going to another fight. Seal's getting in trouble. He can jump by the cure and the seal. And now, now we're going to say, we well, not, you are a boy, our boy. And he did. Q. Oh my god, that he was melting. Melting, I tell you. And now it's just a rampage trying to dag go and take the drone go out. We were saying we are not while you do this rampage. Count is queen up the Kira. Now I'm going to blink on the rampage. Howie is going to be the next one down, out. And look, look how much damage he's taking. He was taking a miss amount of damage to the rampage. But Inferno and the true damage passive from Kira. All one time. The two carries and both have white seal. It's kind of like a rush to finish, ladies and gentlemen. We just waiting on minion. Meanwhile, back to Fang Tooth. Dun, 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 dun. They got it. And I'm going right wing because it's a push up tier 2.
Sell by saying, man, I could put you tier two with no problem because everyone's gone. I said, hmm. Oh, well, so it's too late to do that, buddy. He tried to play by saying, oh, he's not going to follow me. I said, dude, I don't mind. Look how much damage this man takes from true damage. He did. That was like true damage and uh, Inferno all one time taking on Sev. Taking down his health. Taking him down one by one by Inferno. The cure of Rampage will definitely took out my seal. I feel sad. And their seal. So I don't know what's going on here because they will go like three or four on one side. Or they just go ahead and just dead ball. We might all just losing out one a lot when doing so. And the last card will be Viper. So I'm going down mid this time around. We're going to get try and see how much damage we can do with how it's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, melted. The true damage and burn them all one time. Ready, gentlemen. We're just melting him. Some Chris was at 961. And we just have three Fang Tooth now. That's another big boost that we have. Over there with Primal Fang. It's... It's pretty much looking kind of grim on the opponent type, I mean, on the opponent side. You know, they had 22 kills. They have been grouping up and they've just been, um, what the word is, uh, getting melted all one time. So we got go to Prime. This is going to be easy with two carries. And look how much Prime helps it kick down. Look how fast it's going down. Like, for real. Look, look at it. This is melting. I say I'm ready. I'm ready for this. My body's ready. I, I didn't have no time to go back because we're going to be fighting here. This is, I think, is like a fun little showing of pure damage. Rampage is so tanky, he's just in my face, man. I was asked for help right here. I think I almost got away, but I didn't. But no worries, no worries. It was a four to one, but they quit. But I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And if y'all like some more posts, uh, commentary like this, uh, just leave a comment underneath the, you know, the vid. Queen did good that round. We all did good. And I think um, I out damaged the Kira on him. I mean, heroes. Am I right? Yeah. I out damaged her. She only had 19,000. So I have over 10k more than her. You know, she was out the lane more. But we ended 11, 5, and 9. So thanks for watching, y'all. See y'all next time.